What do you not want to ask Godwin? No, I what do you, what do you want to ask Blackstar? Yeah, I do. What do you um, like about your job? The best part of my job is interacting with the young people. Just so many different characters, um, different backgrounds, and they all got a story to tell. So you've got hey. to trade five friends, I've got the two friends, I ain't got time for a license to My name's Two C and I'm the two friends, you trade four seven, man's on that friend. I started freestyling on pre playgrounds in like year five, I think. Mm. And then it was really about year nine. And that's when I said I really wanted to start taking it seriously. So um, literally, I just started listening to instrumentals, learning how to write on different BPMs, different tempos, learning different skills, different styles. So how I actually got into West London or Bolo, bear in mind, I was like 15, 14. I haven't really traveled around London at this time. Yeah, so I, tra I remember traveling like three to four hours on the bus. And I came here, but I waited like three to four hours again just to record. So next time when I see two birds, I got one stone for them, so you better disperse. Chasing these holes only gets you hurt, and then even though love is a curse, I still think about her. 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 Ah, oh, I still think about her. I won't lie, music can save my life, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I generally feel like music can save my life personally. I feel like going to a studio, finding a beat, working with a producer, like just gathering the community together to make amazing music, I generally feel like that is the peak and the pinnacle. I am Somali and stuff like this can be a taboo, you know? Singing can be a taboo, making music can be a taboo, but it's just you have to be real with what you want. And every time I make a new song, I feel like my inner child is smiling, happy, happy that I'm doing what I want to do. I don't like you and she likes everyone And I never lied to admit I was wrong It's just like almost like an unworldly experience Like you're in the studio, you're making music And sometimes I'm there and I'm like I can't believe I've gotten this far But I just feel like I have capability I feel so like able, you know, to do things And music is just empowering, I feel like it's a unique thing and I feel blessed that I get to be around people who make music. Just ask yourself If I handed you well Do you know how I feel? Do you know how I feel when you um, I didn't really realise it was actually a, a youth centre at first, I thought it was just a studio. I just think finding a safe space where you can come in, you've got people that care, you've got people that you can trust, you've got people that are, will keep you grounded. And because obviously it's, it's free, I can come in and try new things um, without feeling uh, any debt to anyone or anything like that, or I'm just wasting time. Like I could just be free and just create as much as I wanted. Oh, Swim above the surface I'll be there to guide you out. Any government entity who's listening to this did not defund this place, please. Like there are so many talents here, you guys have no idea. It is important because it gives people like us that don't have a lot of money, a place to be here, record, make art, just express ourselves. We don't even need to be big stars. We don't need to be the superstar. We just need to express ourselves, you feel me? We just need to be here and make art. Even if we're gonna end up, I don't know, like being accountant or whatever. It's just a way to express ourselves. And it's really important that we do so, especially young people. Especially people that maybe instead of putting energy into the streets, they put energy into the studio. You feel me? That's probably better.